Hafe de Guam, as you can see, I am makeupless, not a drop of makeup on this face, but that's not going to be the case for long. I am here with the amazing, the talented, the beautiful, I could rave on and on about this woman behind me, Michelle Dot Dot, one of the most talented makeup artists here on island and also the most famous, she's Instagram famous guys, 55,000 followers and she's so humble about it. You can follow her, but more on that later, I am not dressed in my usual clothes. This is a circus theme we're going to go for today, so she's going to help us with two looks. The first one is kind of pretty, and the next one is pretty scary. So stick around. So basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start off um, with the sort of simple, easy look to do. Um, I'm going to try to use as much as possible drugstore products that you can easily find, either at Kmart or Rexall or wherever else you buy your beauty products. And I'm gonna start off with a nice basic look and then add a few touches to make it into a more circusy type of theme. And then later on we'll turn it up into something a little bit scarier. So I'm basically just gonna do like a regular like smoky eye on you. Okay. Like a dark, dark, like pretty much black. So kind of just go through your makeup routine but exaggerate everything? Yeah. Now I'm just kind of filling in your waterline because if I'm going to make your eyes like really dark and evil, I want like all of the skin around your eyes to be really dark. So I'm going to add a couple of things just to kind of give it more of like that clown feel. Right now I'm just using a regular like black eyeshadow and a flat angled brush and just kind of just dragging that down there and then I can fill up the sides to get that sort of like triangle type of shape. I got these like little rhinestone things that I got at Shop for Less for like $1.99 for this whole entire bag. For right now, we're just kind of gonna turn it up a little bit and add a couple more uh, touches to this to kind of make it a really like gory type of look. The first part was a little bit more pretty and then this is where it starts to get pretty scary. Mm -hmm. So I'm taking some really basic like uh, liquid latex that you can get from any costume store, like Dungeon, or you could even use the little sets that come at um, those uh, Halloween sets at Kmart. And I'm basically just laying down some liquid latex onto that strip there. This part we're going to be painting white. This is going to be like a little um, special effect type of look where it's going to look like the skin is actually splitting. So this is just basic like facial tissue that you probably have already at home. And I laid the liquid latex down and I'm just going to lay this in like two parts. So I stripped them down into strips. You can also with this process you can actually use um, regular like school glue that you can find at Kmart or whatever also. You can do the same process. I feel like paper mache right now, which is basically the process you're doing. Pretty much. <laughs> so I'm just kind of doing little droplets everywhere and I'm gonna make it run off. Thanks so much, Michelle. This is our final look, our circus ringmaster look that you can wear to shine this weekend. Any last words, Michelle? Um, I, I just say, you know, it's Halloween. It's a time to have fun and be whoever you want. And just really don't stress too much about it. These are things that you can easily find at local stores and do yourself. Or you might even have some of these products already at home. So, you know, just have fun with it. Play around with it. Doesn't have to be perfect, just as long as you like it. And that's all that matters. And again, where can we find more information on you and booking information? Um, I do have an Instagram page if you want to take a look at more of my work. It's m.makeup. Um, if you do want to email me for inquiries, you can email me at m.makeup at gmail.com. And don't forget to have fun and be safe this weekend. Again, no one was hurt in the making of this tutorial. <laughs> Happy Halloween, Guam. <laughs>